News 46 is brought to you in part by... The Pahrump Nug is thirsty with fun. With over 550 machines, we have the biggest slot floor in town. Five levels of play and new machines arriving daily. Our huge pit is open 24-7 and is the most comfortable in town. Plus, we have the finest poker room. Play bingo, browse our gift shop, or enjoy the live entertainment at the stage bar. Our cosmic bowling show is out of this world. Children can play at Kids Venture or at the arcade while you get pampered at a touch of gold beauty salon. We also have three restaurants for your dining enjoyment. Centrally located on the corner of Highway 160 at 372. Uh, this is the sixth year. So this is our sixth year. So we've been at it for a while now. How's the weekend been going? Uh, it's been uh, really good. Um, our numbers are up from last year. So every year it's progressively been, been getting better. So. I know that uh, Joni's your lovely co-host here. How are you doing, Joni? Oh, I'm wonderful tonight. How many films did we have actually entered this year? Um, we had, what was About it? About 40 films. Right, 40 films, 189 submitted, and we picked 40, so. And let's go through the weekend. On Friday night, we had some comedy. Uh, yes, we had comedy. In mm -hmm. addition to that, what were the other genres we had? After comedy, we had some drama, and then we moved into horror and sci-fi. We went probably till like 1 a.m. in the morning. And I know that you got to have the behind the scenes of Pitching Hope, which Joni is a star of. Right, yes, uh, on Saturday night we were able to show that at the end. Um, it was again just kind of a, a tribute to the people of Pahrump that were uh, been supporting us for the whole year. So, Once again, remind everybody about Pitching Hope. It's a full length film and uh, you're going to Sundance with it, right? Um, our intentions are mm -hmm. in December to uh, submit to compete at Sundance. And, mm -hmm. and there's also going to be a private screening at Gideon Film Festival August 6th. And then just to let the locals know, there will be also another private screening here, and that will be announced later on. Where's Gideon? Oh, Gideon is in Ridgecrest, North Carolina. And tell a little bit about the awards. I know we have the Lulus here behind us, and what categories do we have for um, the awards? Okay, the uh, Lulu Awards uh, were from a, a lady here in town that basically uh, we, we accepted her suggestions and what have you. It's an honor to her. Um, Lulu Bremer. Yes, exactly. And um, the awards tonight will be presented for drama, mm -hmm. for comedy, for animation, mm -hmm. and for horror and sci-fi. In addition to that, we also have an Audience Choice Award, yeah. which will be presented also. I think it's important also to know that we picked up some sponsors this year. ImageWest.tv is a lighting company out of Las Vegas that donated like $1,500 worth of equipment to be given to prize winners. And also um, Paul Bautista, who's an entertainment lawyer out of Los Angeles, uh, donated his books so that we could give these to some of the winners. So We had the opportunity to meet everybody on the red carpet. Can you tell me about the, the poster that we have behind us? Uh, yes, the poster is a, a product of a competition, a high school competition, where as you can see in the hallway, there's just uh, a, a large number of them, that have kids that competed for the design. Um, this individual uh, con uh, competed, he was chosen, and now became this, uh, this year's poster awardee and uh, representation of the festival. So, I know we're just about to start the awards ceremony, but tell everybody how they can get involved for next year's. Um, best thing to do is just go to the website highdesertshortsiff.com. Uh, there you'll have contact information, email addresses, and everything. Call us, uh, email us, tell us what you're interested in, what your skills are, and we'll find you we'll find you a place. So.